79-year-old Darry Cropper has been receiving support at home from SB Cares since March after being diagnosed with dementia. He and his wife Trish have both tested positive for COVID-19. It comes after an outbreak of 26 coronavirus cases linked to their hometown of Jedburgh. Last week, NHS Borders and Scottish Borders Council confirmed the outbreak is associated with home care services provided by SB Cares and that care workers are among those infected. As Darry and Trish have now both been admitted to hospital, we spoke to daughter Shirley, who's concerned there's been transmission between staff and clients. We're all terrified. My dad um, has a long-term illness. Um, We are terrified for him. We're terrified for Trish because... Um, her family have been on the phone to me as well. Um, they're crying all the time. Um, sorry. We're all anxious as well. And we're trying our best to protect my dad. And we've tried our best. And um, this still happens. And we don't really want to blame specific carers. And we just want the system to be looked at to make sure it doesn't happen. Somebody else. Scottish Borders Council confirmed there are now five members of SB Care staff and seven clients who have tested positive. Shirley says she's concerned about the personal protective equipment worn by home care staff. I don't believe that they're wearing the right PPE to be doing very intimate, uh, close contact with people, vulnerable adults. My question, I suppose, to SB Cares and NHS Borders is if this has happened, and it could happen again, which could be a disaster, and still may be a disaster for us, um, surely they should be looking into an investigation of what's gone on and questioning the PPE that their carers are being given. The local authorities said there are no issues with supplies of PPE. In a statement, they said the purpose of PPE is to protect the wearer. Whilst our staff did not work while displaying typical COVID-19 symptoms, they were working while potentially infectious. Of course, they were completely unaware of this. In such circumstances, even the correct wearing of full PPE by staff does not mean clients were not at risk of catching the virus. The council added that although the testing of SB Care's residential care home staff takes place on a weekly basis as per national guidance, there is no guidance regarding the testing of home care staff, therefore they are tested when symptomatic. Tonight, Darry and Trish remain in hospital. Shirley tells us her stepmum is very unwell. The family hope both make a quick recovery, but are still wondering how they ended up here in the first place. Claire McNeil, ITV News.